what is going on guys so today we are heading over to houston to run the vintage park 13.1 half marathon uh not feeling the greatest this morning this is what i'm gonna drink this is what i was drinking last night so i do need to hydrate because it's gonna be a little warm it's gonna be about 70 degrees today and uh crawl its way up so let's go to houston made it here to vintage park i had to pay 10 bucks for race day packet pickup uh but uh, it's worth it because i didn't want to stay at a hotel so i had to leave early so let's go pick up the packet <music> all right so this is what i got i got my bib, you guys already saw the bib. And then I also have the vintage 13.1 half marathon shirt. And then we'll get a finisher's cap at the end of this race as well. What else they have in there? They have some steak seasoning from the beef team. And what else cool they have inside the packet? What is this? This is a lens cleaner when you clean your glasses. It's actually, I'll use that, leave that in the truck. That's about it. The rest is like paper stuff. So, I guess I'll take this out because I'll throw this bag away. All right, so got another 30 more minutes, probably another 10, 15 minutes till I head out there. I do need to uh, set up my other camera because I need this memory card in this camera to put into this camera, so. All right, guys, see you guys in this camera. All right, about to start 647. I think the Ainsley Angels are going to go off first. And then we're going to go out. My time goal is going to be 220 to 230. So, or hopefully better. We'll see how I feel. It's going to be a warm one today. A damn selfie stick just popped off my 360 camera onto the ground, scratched both lenses. That's $400 down the drain. That camera's useless now. It's a good thing to do before mile one. Not too happy about that. But anyway, let's keep on going. All right, that's mile two. Much of the wind in my sail has gone after I, I dropped my freaking camera. I do have this GoPro, so that's what I'm holding on now. We have 11.1 more miles to go. Sun is rising, it's gonna get warm real soon. <laughs> the uh, 230 pace group is right behind me. They're probably gonna pass me up soon enough. I'm gonna change my goals to uh, 230 to 240. I think that's more realistic for the day in my fitness level. Thank you. Told you say, say my name. Good job. Thank you. That's John Walk. Hey. 
the five carries are finishing over there. We got a long more, a lot more to do. All right, so that water stop is to go. Uh, that's halfway. I'm at uh, 115, so 2:30 to uh, 2:40. May do it, may not do it. You know what? Today, I think I don't even care. Just gonna finish this, like all my other races. So let's go. So if you guys don't know, I'm throwing my own race on May 14th, Shannon's Run 5K, 10K. It's gonna be in Orange, Texas. I invite all y'all to sign up. I'll actually put a special discount code down in the description below for y'all if y'all want to sign up. But I just asked them how many officers they have at this race. And the uh, one cop at the stoplight said about 60. So. You want to say 60 times 40, 6, 12, 18, $24,000 just for cops. That's what you got to think about now that I'm a race director. That's expensive. But a half marathon, you get a lot more money than a 5K or 10K. So there is that, but still $24,000 for cops. That's a lot. We're at mile right over mile seven i think i kind of stopped looking at my watch right now i'm just focusing on keeping a steady even pace who cares about my pace right now just going out here to finish it the good thing about this course is that there is a lot of shade right now in the sun but as the day gets later the sun will be overhead and there'll be no hiding from it so just gonna keep on chugging along just past a uh, mile eight got a uh, what's that five more miles ago five point one making a turn just about to hit mile nine so right now I'm on like cruise control when you're on empty just trying to make it the distance without running out of gas <coughs> four wait one more mile to go there's some uh, nice people cheering the people that cheer out here are the cops because there's so many of them but check out these people all right thank you Check out these freaking mansions over here. Huge houses. The trees are still shading us from the sun, so that's good. Almost a mile ten. Yeah, there's a nice breeze. The breeze is cooling you down too. It's a really nice course. Good job. About 11. 2.1 more to go. 2.1 more to go. Mile 12, 1.1 more to go. I don't know how much I have in the tank to uh, kick it in. So I have to conserve my energy. Now yeah, I'm pretty spent. There's a guy doing Galloway method. I was trying to follow him. Couldn't even do that. So just gotta run my race, finish it off. One, one more mile to go probably now. Just can't have the, uh, the 245 catch me. I wanna beat them at least. Ah. 
cramping. I got Woo! Yeah. <laughs>